Hi fish lovers I welcome you all to my channel Blue Aquatics I hope you all are doing well Friends are you looking for the best tank cleaners for your fresh water aquarium or searching for the best fishes which can help in controlling the growth of algae in your fresh water aquarium friends if you are looking for set then you are in the right place in this video you will be able to know which is the best algae eater for your aquarium before starting our main topic let me tell you how algae grow in an aquarium see there are many factors due to which algae grow and out of those the main are sunlight uneaten fish food and fish waste so if you are also facing the problem of algae growth in your fresh water tank from these factors then just add these algae eaters in your tank to make your tank free from algae i am sharing the best algae eaters list with you in this video and you can select which is the best option for you according to your requirements let me tell you about the fishes first the first fish is bristle nose pleco these fishes are commonly available in different color varieties like gold and albino these fishes look very good and you can say that it is a great addition to your tank if you have a tank with driftwood and hiding spaces then this algae eater is a very good option for you the second is siamese algae eater This algae eater is again a very good option in controlling the algae of your tank. This fish can eat multiple types of algae which the other algae eaters ignore. This fish is very peaceful and is a very good option for beginners. third is chinese algae eaters these fishes are mainly kept in african chichilid tanks because of their aggressive behavior these fishes can reach up to 10 inches in size so it's risky to keep in community tanks after they grow near to 6 to 7 inches fourth is autosynclus catfish autosynclus algae eaters are another good option this fish grows to a maximum of 2 inches unlike chinese algae eaters these fishes are very peaceful and should not be kept with african chichlids then comes twig catfish these algae eaters are very peaceful fishes and love to live with species such as tetras guys don't keep these fishes with any large fishes or the chichlid variety the twig catfish is kept mostly in pairs and 
require a water pH between 6 to 8. This fish is a very good option among the algae eater family. Then comes whiptail catfish. The temperament of this fish is similar to twig catfish. The food of this catfish is algae and the pellets which you feed to your other fishes available in the tank. This fish is also a very good option in controlling algae growth. Then comes the sucker fish. This is a common name for bottom feeding algae eaters. They are popular as they help to clean the tank. These fishes can reach up to 2 feet in length. They not only depend upon the algae but also upon the regular fish feed. Other than fishes, snails are also a good option for a fresh water tank in cleaning algae. Here is a list of snails which you can add in your tank that eat algae. The first is mystery apple snail. These snails can grow very big. These are available in multiple colors. These snails love to eat glass algae, plant algae and substrate algae. Then comes Malaysian trumpet snail. These snails have very long shells as you can see in the image as well. They love to eat different type of algae and is a very good option for a planted tank. The third one is Ram's Horn Snail. This snail is shaped like a ram's horn, so thus named as Ram's Horn Snail. This variety of snail loves to eat different types of algae and also any uneaten food. Don't keep them with chitlets and other predatory fishes as this snail can become a target for them. Then comes is Norite snail. Norite snails are considered as the best algae eaters in snail species. These snails can eat any type of algae. They remain very small in size so think twice before keeping them with any predatory fish. These snails also come in different types of colors. Then comes a rabbit snail. Rabbit snails have a long pointed shell just like Malaysian trumpet snails. These snails can grow up to 5 inches in length. These snails can also eat any type of algae and can also eat plants decomposed material. Now as I can say that apart from fishes and snails there are some shrimps available in the fresh water tank which can eat algae and clean up the tank. So let's start with different types of shrimps one by one. First is bamboo shrimp. These shrimps are considered as one of the larger species of algae eating in the shrimp list. These shrimps can eat both algae and feeding wafers. They can grow to a size of 2 to 3 inches in length. Then comes Anemo Shrimp. The care for these shrimps is very easy and does not require any special treatment. These shrimps can easily live with peaceful fishes. 
these are considered as very good algae eaters and side by side also eats uneaten fish food and other detritus the third ones are ghost shrimps these shrimps have a transparent body and have an orange or yellow spot on the tail which helps in identifying them they are not as good as others in the tank cleaning process but can help a little bit these shrimps also love to live with the fishes which are non aggressive then comes cherry shrimps as you can see in the image these are bright red and are good option for algae eating if you want best from their side then keep them in a group they work well in planted tanks and can easily live with peaceful fishes so summing up If we talk about the best algae eater then there is no suitable species which fits your needs The best algae eater for your aquarium depends upon the various factors like which type of fishes are available in the tank size of your tank and the type of algae in the aquarium All you can do is to do some research before putting these species into the tanks. After doing research, the species which can live properly in your aquarium should only be kept as a pet for algae eating. Friends, I had tried to cover almost all the best species available for tank cleaning process if you know any other species which is also good then please comment in a comment section so that it is helpful for others as well thanks for watching this video guys i hope you liked it For watching more such informative videos do subscribe to my channel and ring the bell so you never miss any important update stay tuned stay healthy and have a happy fish keeping